getting out again at last. Got a cold camp tonight. Temperatures are to get down to about minus, well, it says minus two at Creef, and we are, I think, about 300 meters higher than Creef, just behind Ben Honze. Right, let's get set up because uh, it'll be getting dark soon. How's that for opening the tent in the morning? New bit of gear. I've upgraded the Flextail Tiny Pump to the latest one. Uh, I've always liked them, but the last one did my nothing because it kept falling off. If I've got some footage, I'll stick it on now. But this blows up the mat so much quicker. And I don't need to hold it in place. Back out in the X bed down mat, light five medium. And the sleeping bag is my winter one now. Mountain Hardware Lamina Flame Z. So my sleeping bag's rated for minus six. And let's say Creef's meant to get down to about minus two tonight, but we're we're a good bit higher than Creef. So it it might be stretching the sleeping bag a wee bit. And that's me all set up. Out in the Cloud Peak 2 again tonight. Should be cozy. Stunning area though. We're at Loch Turret for this wee, this wee camp, um, organised by, by Wolf. My beard on straight. <laughs> and it's about 350 metres above sea level, just behind Creef. A little bit busier than what I'm used to. There's uh, quite a lot of dog walkers and things like that. Stunning area though. We're not far from the car, it's... Uh, just a, a few hundred metres. You'll see that in the drone footage. Time to get the dinner on. My hands are starting to cold, get cold, so I'll stick this on so I can get my gloves on once I've cooked it. Chicken tikka for tonight's tea. Chicken was marinated already. And then I've got just got like a, a jar of sauce. But it should be lovely. At least you get a good heat off of the trangia. Slightly warming my hands up. Just one of these wee things I've got. Never tried them before. Hopefully it's all right. Of course, it's not going to come out very easy, though, is it? And what I'll do is I'll just put the rice straight in there. Probably won't need all of it. It maybe doesn't look the most appetising, but I'm sure it'll be lovely. Looks not bad. Hopefully it tastes all right. It's hot. Actually, it's really quite tasty. Very simple for on a, a camp. 
and fairly cheap too. Winner! So that's it, just coming up to six o'clock. And we're already at minus one. Well that's it, it's pitch black now. So I'm going to take some photographs of the stars, settle down with a beer and chill out for the rest of the night. So it's got down to minus four already. It's about midnight and this is the inside of my tent. Oh, time to get in the sleeping bag. So I really hope this sleeping bag warms up quickly because it's freezing. Uh, I trust it though. I reckon it'll be alright. I love that sleeping bag. That was a, a really warm sleep. I was roasting. Got out of the bed this morning though and now oh, it's freezing again. I've lost my wee thermometer though, so I've got no idea what the temperature is. You seen the trans here yesterday, but I've got the X boil as well. Why not? We're camping beside the car, so <coughs> can carry as much as I want. Just really wanted to try this wee thing out. I've not used it yet. Similar to the similar to the Luxada thing that I had, uh, but this is going to be more stable apparently. We'll see though. Kind of want to test how much fuel it uses as well. Got that wee bottle of mess. Let's put a wee bit in. Go for half the bottle. Probably should have had the pot stands on first. It is all really cold though, so it's probably going to take quite a lot to boil. Right, see what happens there. Getting there. Alright, let's see if I can do this without spilling it all over the place. Coffee with a view. It's another fantastic adventure, but time to get packed up and head home. <laughs>